Hey everyone, welcome back to Andy Demos. Today I'm taking a look at the Body Breaker from SNK Pedals, and this is known for being a very aggressive overdrive that easily goes into distortion territory. So let's take a look. With an op amp based overdrive circuit pushed by a JFET stage and using MOSFET clipping, the range of gain and distortion is immense, going from light breakup to tight distortion and even super compressed searing sustain. The voicing of the body breaker is fine tuned with a tone knob that rolls off high frequencies and a mid knob that cuts or boosts mid range. Together with tremendous output volume, you can dial an amp pushing overdrive without even turning the drive knob above noon. Like all SNK pedals, the body breaker is handmade one at a time in small batches in New Jersey, USA, and it's filled with high quality components and runs off a standard nine volt DC power supply. So if you couldn't tell from the intro, there's plenty of potential for gain and distortion with this pedal. So let's just focus on that aspect. Keep the mids kind of flat and shave off just a little bit of top end because it gets kind of hairy when you crank up the gain. So there's your gain range, which is actually way beyond a classic screamer or even sort of a rat distortion. But let's focus on the other parameters, and that's the mids, the tone, as well as the output, which is way beyond unity gain. So I'm going to keep the gain back and get some different tones with the other parameters.
just back off the mids a little bit and it's not gonna be too much going into a clean fender. And I wanna show you how the highs stay really glassy, even with the tone below noon. It has a huge range, so it's not one of these pedals you have to be afraid of turning the tone control up past noon to get any usable settings. You could actually back it off all the way as you heard. Body Breaker is sort of known for having a very gnarly tone that's just perfect for riffs or detuned guitars, but actually if you crank up the gain, you get into that MOSFET clipping, which can be very smooth, it adds extra compression. You kind of get into that, you know, epic lead tone territory with the neck pickup, especially if you back off on the tone and crank up the mids. <laughs> And for the last example, I want to show you how the Body Breaker gets along with my 100 watt Marshall. And this is mainly because this amp has so much, you know, dirt on its own as well as mid-range. The mid-range control on the Body Breaker really helps sort of, you know, kind of hone in the low end and add some brightness back. And you'll see what I mean. I'm going to start with the mids kind of flat. And then when I back them off, it just kind of adds all this extra sparkle and it prevents the amp from getting muddy, especially with something so high gain as the Body Breaker. <laughs> Well, there's your look at a very aggressive overdrive and distortion from SNK, the Body Breaker. You can find out all about it at snkpedals.com or click the links below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you for another Andy demo.